Hello everyone, welcome back to Summarize and Memorize. We will be doing question 8 to 10 of graded assignment 4. Question number 8 says, let fx and dx be two function defined from r to r. Now fx has this expression when x lies between these values. fx is this expression when x lies between these interval. And fx is 1 for minus 4, minus 2, 2 and 4. And gx is modulus of x. Now we need to find the value of this big expression. This is a very simple question because both the expressions have been given to us of fx and gx. And we need to only substitute the values of x into this equation and find out the value and substitute them into the this big expression. Simple. Let's see the solution. So see, I need to find f of 4. So f of 4 was given as 1 g of minus 4 will be 4. Why? Because modulus function gives us positive value. f of 0. f of 0 lies between minus 2 and 2. So, it lies between red region. Red is denoted by first equation. So, what do you x ki value ki jaga 0 put kar dena hai and f of 0 aapko mil jayega. That is 64. g of minus 64 will be obviously 64. f of 3. So, 3 lies between 2 and 4. Correct. So, it's between green region and what is green region my second equation or expression so second expression may i will be putting x as 3 and find out f of 3 that is 35 g of 40 will come out as 40 we got all the values of this big expression let's substitute so this is f of 1 g of minus 4 f of 0 g of minus 64 f of 3 and g of 40. Solve it and you will get the answer as 0. Simple. Let's move towards ninth question. So let rx be a polynomial function which is obtained as a question after dividing the polynomial px by the polynomial qx. So basically this is a division. If we are dividing px by qx, we will find rx. Now we need to find the graph of rx from these four options. Easy question. So let's substitute the value of px and qx. Luckily, these gets cancelled out. So rx will come out as minus of x plus 5, x minus 3. So this is a quadratic expression. So we will get parabolic, you know, graph. Negative sign here. So it will be a downward parabola. And roots are minus 5 and 3. So after gathering all these information, let's figure out the graph. This is a upward parabola. So this gets rejected. Upper parabola, reject. Downward parabola, very nice. But the roots were minus 5 and 3. And here are roots kya hai? 3 and 5. So this gets rejected. Let's see the last option. Roots are minus 5 and 3. And this is a downward parabola. Therefore, the correct option will be C1. Let's move towards the last question. So a, B, C are the roots of a polynomial and the sum of root is 0. We need to find the value of this expression. See, this is a cubic equation and if we know the roots of cubic expression, we can write the cubic expression using this knowledge, correct? So now let's, you know, compare this first equation which is already given to the into the question and this knowledge which we know from our 9, 10th class. So, when we will compare, we know that ABC will be 0, that is sum of roots will be 0, product of roots will be 9 and similarly multiplication of two roots ka summation will be 13. This I got on comparing and same thing was given in the question as well, that sum of roots was 0, which I have figured comparison So, if this information is not same we had still we had the same answer, because same approach. Hoki. अब मुझे यार ये वाली वैल्यू निकालनी है तो जैसे ही हमने ये चीज देखी वी रियलाइज्ड कि यार ये तो हमारे 9 10th का फार्मूला यूज होगा दैट इज a cube plus b cube plus c cube minus 3 a b c विल बी इक्वल टू द समेशन इनटू a square plus b square plus c square दैट इज स्क्वायर्स minus ab minus bc minus ca forget about this term why kyunki yaar abc hi zero hai to ye mera jo rhs part hai this is complete zero so aq plus bq plus c cube will be equal to 3abc 
एंड एबीसी की वैल्यू मैंने क्या निकाली थी नाइन आफ्टर कंपेरिजन सो द फाइनल आंसर ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन विल बी थ्री इन टू नाइन एंड दैट इज ट्वेंटी सेवन so that's all in this video i hope you understood all the three questions if you like this video then do subscribe to the channel